Hi friends, in this video I'm going to write a small Java program to calculate football game points using map. For example, here is the football games points 3 colon 1, 2 colon 2 and 0 colon 1. The idea here is if x is greater than y then 3 points. If x is equal to y then 1 point and if it is less it is 0. For example, if you take the points for series of matches x is greater than y then 3 points. x is equal to y then 1 point. If it is less then 0. Similarly, we got the other match points. So when we calculate this, the total match points would be 11. Now let's see the Java program to calculate the total match points. I've written the class called football match points and there are a set of games which is stored in the string array. And there are two methods. One is using the traditional for loop and then the other one is using streams. The first method we are going to receive a string array and then iterate using the for loop. So each iteration we will take each game and then split using the colon meaning we'll be getting the first number and the second number. We will store these two numbers in the x and y variable and then compare. For example, if x is greater than y then 3 match points. If x is equal to y then 1 match point otherwise 0. So get the result added to the total match points and keep doing the same for other games as well. Finally, we'll be getting the total match points and print it in the console. In the second method, we are going to take the string array and create a stream and then call map to int method. So map is used for transforming from one form to the other form. So here what we do is like we have a lambda expression. Take each game score and then the first number and the second number. Do the difference. 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. So 2 is greater than 0, then we will get 3 points. If the game is 2 is to 2, then we will get the difference as 0 then the match point would be 1. So for each game we will be getting the points and then finally call the sum method to find out the total match points. And finally print the total match points in the console. When I run this program I am able to see the total match point is 11 printed in the console. It's a very small program. Please try out. Hope this video is useful. Thank you.